So this is Dane, we're a reviewer, and today I am going to do something a little bit different. Today I am going to be reviewing Dragonheart 2 A New Beginning. See, I like the original Dragon Art because of Dennis Quaid and Sean Connery as Drago. And the film made for a fun popcorn flick. It was this type of film that either you like or you don't like. You hate it or you don't hate it. That was Dragon Heart. And that was good for what it was. I loved it because I think Sean Connery did a fine job as Drago and Dennis Quaid did a fine job as the knight that was sworn to protect Ainan, but Ainan turned into a little asshole and he wanted to see him killed. And the reason Ainan was alive, because that, that, that kind of made sense for story-wise. He had half of Drago's heart. So you would think... Once they killed Drago, that would have been it. There would have been no other. There would have been no other Dragon Hearts. Well, sad to say, they actually made three extra sequels: Dragon Heart: A New Beginning, Dragon Heart Three: A New Hope. Or some shit like that in Dragon Heart. For Heart Fire or some crap like that. See, now Dragon Heart 2. It is not a bad film. It's not a good film. It's a film that's just okay. It's a film that honestly, if you're out of options and you've seen all the good shit you have and you want to put something on just to watch, you can do it. And you'll be fine. You won't hurt yourself. As long as you go in knowing that no sequel that they make to Dragonheart, the original, is going to live up to it. If you go in with low standards and you check yourself at the door and you go in and you just have fun with the popcorn flick, then you'll be okay. Now, if you're going to go into Dragonheart... A new beginning, and you're expecting a performance like Sean Connery gave and like Dennis Quaid gave, then you're sorely mistaken. Because I don't know who the new actor that played Drake that played Drake was. The kid that became Drake's mentor and friend was unlikable. I mean. He was an okay actor, but he was stale and bland. He brought nothing to the table. It was like if he was almost not even there. As for Drake himself, I gotta be honest. For a long time, people have cried and complained that they can uh, see bad CGI when they're watching a film. This is the type of film where the CGI, sh where you can tell it's a CGI dragon cropped into the background of the film. When you can tell that your dragon is CGI, then you know somebody somewhere fucked up. And that person shouldn't work on a film again. That's all I'm going to say. When you know that the dragon is CGI... And it's not supposed to be CGI. It's supposed to look real. Somewhere, somebody fucked up. And that person should be found and fired. And shouldn't be allowed to work on movies. As for the story itself, it's simplistic. Boy finds young dragon. Boy bonds with young dragon. Boy becomes a dragon rider. And boy has to stop evil from taking over a kingdom same shit as 
the original Dragonheart, except for the fact that Dennis Quaid had to stop Ainin's evil reign and had to kill Draco in the process. If I recommend this film to you, it's only because I want you to see it for a so, so bad that it's almost good type of film. But in good conscience, I can't recommend this film to you because then that means you'd actually have to go out and buy a copy. And if you're going to do that, buy a copy, you're just selling out to the consumer. And you're just okaying these shitty sequels of once great films. I mean, the original Dragonheart, it was good for what it was. I loved it. And, you know, it told a story. It did good at telling that story. And that's where it should have ended. It should have ended with Draco's death. But somewhere, somebody got a genius idea. You know what? We can top Sean Connery and Dennis Quaid. We'll make a, a sequel to an already great film. But we'll turn our sequel shitty. And people will watch because th their curiosity is going to get the best of them. And that is true. Your curiosity is going to get the best of you. You're going to see a Dragonheart movie. And you're going to you're gonna want to watch it. I mean, the film is fine for kids that don't know better. But us adults that have seen the original and have, still have it fresh in our mind, it's going to be dog shit to us. And that's what the film is. The film is dog shit. It's not bad, it's not good, it's just there. It's just something you watch when you don't feel like looking for anything else. But I'm me, you're you, Jason O'Connor, here's another review, I'm out.